it's a common. I don't mind taking it. Um, later. What's to say? I think I'm gonna try Krenko. I wouldn't be surprised if Kaya is just the slam pick here, though. Well, now I'm probably just gonna take the Cruelty. You might have to refresh. Um, might have to refresh if it's not showing up. Ooh, Jiang. Third Horde Twins is also not terrible. I'm okay taking a Planeswalker here, though, over, say, the Twins. I don't know. It's close. The Twins seem very good, too. But I guess with Cranko, I'd rather take the Pump. Ah, look at that! Look at that! It was just meant to be. Oh, another really solid pack here. Tabalt, the Rager, and the Epiphany, all great. I think I'm going to go with the Planeswalker, though. I, can fix that. I guess maybe I just take the Guild Globe here for Splashy Splash purposes. And Crocodile or Burning Prophet. Honestly, I'm just going to take the 2-drop. It's a fine common. But we'll take the croc now. Okay, let's take the courage. We do have the Cranko after all. Our fire on the wheel is absolutely fine. Catharsis is playable. I do like a Manticore at the top end. So the Stone Blades is good with Cranko, but I don't think it's a good card by itself, so. Hmm. Bloom Hulk, I guess. Is my pick. <coughs> Excuse me. Blue Mulk's just one of the best green commons, I feel like. Uh, let me add a command here real quick. For add com tumor. There we go. There you go. Now you can read the full thread. Guess we'll just take the Nahiri. Another Tabalt. Seems good. I like the Cyclops of Electromancer, but it doesn't look like it's going to be very good in our deck currently. The only thing to fear is... <laughs> everything. I might take the Sprint here. Sprint seems okay. Ooh, yeah! Evolution Sage? We're passing some good ones, though. Arlen's Wolf's a good 3-drop. Giant Growth. Snare Spinner. Hard to pass the Sage now that I've gotten so many Planeswalkers, though. I might take Crunch here over another Pump Effect. I think I just want the Creature. I'll take the Worm over the Stone Blades, but I don't know if I'm going to run it. <clears throat> That's a late Thunderer Strike. City aim is fine. Crocodile. Storm of the Citadel might be playable too if I get enough creatures. What the Parhelion? It's too expensive. Another cruelty here. Kazmina is probably the best card, and then followed by cruelty. Could just take another Crunch, could take Cyclops. I do already have one Cruelty, but I don't have much fixing beyond that one globe. I guess Jang is fixing as well. Since I already have one Cruelty, I could just take a second, but I think I'm just going to go with the 2-drop here. Kind of barfy. Jesus. Oh well, Venerated. Jaya's fine. Keep making that face, and I'll finish Ooh, Paradise Druid is really good. As is Jaya's Greeting and Bloom Hulk. Three very good picks here for us. Budge. God. It might even be correct to take the Bloom Hulk. I'm not even kidding. Bloom Hulk is such a good green common. I'm going for it. I'm going to take the Bloom Hulk over Jaya's Greeting and I'm going to cry. Ooh, Pollen Bright. Another very good one here. It's my first. 
two Heartfire. I mean, I have double Tabalt. I'm not going to play another Crocodile, so it's possible I, I run two Heartfire. Snare Spinner is super good with counters on it. So I don't think I'm playing the Nissa's Triumph, and I already have a Sarkin's Catharsis, so let's take the Snare. Okay. All of these are good choices here. I do like Crunch, and I do like Horizons. I think because we have the double Bloom Hulk and some other ways to uh, synergize with 1-1 counters, it might be the Horizons over Crunch. But let's take a look at my creatures. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 creatures. Okay, so we're, we could take either one and be fine. You have luck, thanks for the 31 months. I am counting Tabalt as a creature, yes. I'm going to go with the Crunch just because we have the double rings, I think, but it's a close one. Elian also might be very playable here. Two is questionable. I'm going to sideboard a statue for slow versus like a slower deck. I already have two heart fires, right? I do. Alright, this deck looks decent. I mean, this is probably my worst card. And I have a plenty of other good ways to pump the Cranko, so I think I'm just going to cut the uh, Sprint. I'm wondering if I should run the Storms, the Citadel, as a bad overrun. Mr. Economical, thanks for that sub. I think it is. Yeah, the Invader's not bad. It's also fine with Tabalt, which I have two of. Ooh, man, Freya just pooped. Ooh, stinky cat. Alright, I'm gonna try it like this. First new laptop in over 10 years? Yikes. Alright, I didn't pick up any uh, forced landings for my excuse me, sideboard. Seems like a crazy good curve. Oh man, if only I was on the play. Aha! Take that, Strix. You don't like Davriel. I don't like that one bit. I think I'm just going to discard the Burning Prophet at this point. A mind is a terrific thing to waste. Next turn I get to go Zhang into Attack Davriel. Probably not going to chump anyways, because they want to uh, prowess and kill Zhang, so. Or not. Alright, I'm going to discard Crocodile here then. Uh, Actually, I could get greedy and discard a land since I have the Snare Spinner technically adding mana. If I get greedy, I could discard Forest here. I don't think Nahiri's a bad pitch either. Yeah. Zhang? When he enters the battlefield, doesn't he say Zhang? My name is Zhang something? I'm pretty sure when you play him, he says, I am Zhang Yanggu. Glue Hefner, thanks for the four months. Oh, I'm sorry, you had to put your cat down. All right, I'm going for greed though. Forest it is. That's interesting. Alright, well now I'm going to discard the crocodile because 
They're going to kill here, and then I'm not going to have the mana. Grogrim, thank you for the two months. God, give me a land next turn. That or have them not attack. Crazy. Three mana, gain three life. I dig it. Courage in Crisis would also be a very good draw. Give my Cranko plus two plus two, proliferate on these two, and then an attack for 5,000. Approximately. I mean, I did discard a land. Oh no, they targeted their own creature. They misclicked. I mean, it probably wasn't going to really matter, because either way, Mowu or Kranko would still be alive, but yeah, the game would be over regardless, but that just makes it super awkward. Oh my god! <laughs> hey, congrats to Zen Master Funk getting that gifted sub from Chewy. This is best of three, remember, so. Crocodile is not bad versus blue black. Might just bring in another croc instead and take out the uh, catharsis. Hmm. Asver Jones, hello. Ship it. Oh boy. I don't think you can go down to five, really. But this hand is kind of stanky. I'm going to bottom the Grey Ogre. Yeah, can I have the London Mulligan for Arena, please? All right. So we'll just draw our way into the curve. Dude, the London Mulligan has been so crazy. I've tried it in both modern and limited now, and it's just... Mm. Sorry, guys. I've been practicing modern off of stream. Been trying quite a few decks. For the box, they gave us accounts to practice with, but we're not allowed to stream on them. <clears throat> this is just total bait, right? Now, they might have the sacrifice a creature, but my guess is that they just have finisher. Uh, this creature becomes relevant if I get the proliferate counter on it, right? Oh. Next turn I can Jaya and attack with the Prophet. Wow, that's how they're spending that their turn. That's great for us. I think I'm going to let Jaya die here if they want to activate the Skulker again like that. There's a very real possibility that the opponent punts here and blocks my Burning Prophet with their uh, Wall of Runes. <laughs> Jaya text, ladies and gentlemen. 
Relevant. That guy Taj. Thanks for seven months. Oh, I guess they don't even need to activate Skulker anymore if I'm attacking with both. In fact, maybe it was just better to attack with a crocodile. Whoops. For some reason, I thought they would have to activate. Yeah, I don't know what I was talking about. That was under the condition that I held back. It's my best draw now. Uh, probably not that. We knew they had that from that attack earlier with the 1-1. One, one. Yo, Victor P. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Oh my. The bad boy. Not the good boy, the bad boy. It's Reaver with a V, not Reaper. Reaver. Okay, take it. Try racing. We'll see if they have the plus two plus so and indestructible. That would be pretty bad. Hoping this is just a chump. Alright, good. Another counter would also suck. The good news is our opponent didn't play any unbeatable bombs. Finisher is going to trade with this crocodile. We'll see if they just eat the 2 2. I don't mind. I push in some extra damage that way. I'll probably end up regretting not killing Dabriel, as is the case with leaving planeswalkers on your. Oops. Uh, to chump with it if they attack with the Skulker and don't pay. I go to seven here. Did I have my Catharsis back that I took out? Wow, maybe they attack with the Skulker and just leave themselves dead on board. That'd also be great. Do it! Attack! Attack! I have no good blocks! I am struggling now. They still have three cards in their hand now, I mean. TSM when? What are you talking about? TSM now. The reason I held the land is so that they would use its ability again. If I play it out, they don't have to use the ability. Tiny, sexy merfolk. I mean, technically, I guess I'm sponsored by TSM, but I, I am part of TSM, if that's what you mean. Aha, maybe that's why they were doing it. They just wanted to be able to reset the loyalty? Alright, well, still win with some pump effects. Courage? And put them to one? Fuck. Fuck. Then I die. Ugh. Avriel's gonna kill me. Or block, block. Oh, I am just dead, you're right. Ah, crap.
It all makes sense now. The good part about this is that uh, their conjurant does get smaller. I guess I needed to not top the Bloom Hulk and hope to draw something else. No, if I attack with all, they they have me dead. Just a Skulker. To their face. That kills me too, right? They play it, right? Oof! Alright, well, not technically dead. So if they had killed my spider, they would have won. Again, I don't know if there's anything I can draw, but... This gives me a shot, I guess. Nope, GG. No, I took out the catharsis. What did I what did I put? I put in another crocodile for it. Is the crocodile maybe not good enough? Let's just bring in a worm. Yeah, Davriel is definitely an, an annoying card if you can't just kill it immediately. I did take the axe out. Look, we're just gonna curve. We're gonna go turn two crunch, turn two, three crunch, turn four mowu. Something like that. So close. Ah. I really don't want to lose this. It's fine, but if they just have one removal spell, it's not very good. Gray Ogre, go. <laughs> this feels bad to lose. I guess I just take it and then go all in. Alright, hope you can't beat a 4 4. Come on. Hmm. Well, I think they're probably going to give me two cards here. Maybe they can kill their own creature. I'll take the two cards, please. <laughs> two cards, please. So bad, dude. You will now perish first. Oh, 
Uh, we just had some unfortunate mulligans, I think. GG's, you're dead. Oh, whoops, I took the chat off. There you go. Yeah, Kazmin is great. I mean, I can't block the operative, but I think that's what I need to play too. Well, the opponent's drawn just about as many lands as I have. Yeah, probably the same. The thing is, they've just drawn two cards that have gotten a lot of value. Oh, I guess two of the cards that they gave me were, were from Obnixilis, though. Uh-oh, they drew something. No, because Obnixilis will be off the battlefield. Can't win if I block, can't win if I don't block. Well, okay, that's not a bad draw. That's not a bad draw at all. I think attacking is correct, even though it looks super awkward. All right, they drew another land. All right. Here they come. They kill the four five. I chump block, but I get to see three new cards. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Do not hold. I don't. I don't lose any life here. Obnixilis is off the battlefield when this happens. We did it! Can I play it all? I can play it all! Oh wait, no I can't. Oh. Oh god. Okay. Dude, we're stable! We're freaking stable! No! <laughs> uh, they do have good walkers though. Dang. They've just drawn three Planeswalkers. If I draw another spell next turn, I might have a shot. There's no point waiting, because it'll just double block Cranko anyways, plus I don't want to get Davriel'd. I have to double block here, so this is more than acceptable. This also makes Cranko a little bit better. Yes, they played their land! Whatever they just drew, they have to discard. Yes! Mm, I think it's just clear that they're... Oh my god, that's an insane draw. I think it's just clear that they're newer to magic.
I have made many worse plays in my life, so don't be too mean. We've all been there. For me, it was just yesterday, so you never know. Oh, wow, Jaya with the frickin' goblin tokens is gross, isn't it? All the goblins yield 2 damage. Just lethal. 4, 5, 6, 7, 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh, I'm one short. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I'm one short. All right, well, we definitely got lucky to win the game. That's all there is to it. No, Jaya says other, so she she herself does not deal three. Oh, baby. Obviously, I need some lands, but and has potential. Sarge three one three zero. Thank you for that Twitch Prime. Oh, Kitty Cat deck. I wonder how many they have. Blue white cats. I think the game plan is just to get Cranko online ASAP. And then hope to draw some uh, backup. But like if they don't do anything this turn, I can attack with Cranko. Uh this was the first one. Pick one, pack one was crank. Okay. So be it. A A to Z. Thanks, my friend. Wow, how did they see that block? Ayo, hey, it's Tayo. I guess that's a roundabout way to make a 2-2 two -two cat. <laughs> they don't gain life. Are they going face? I mean, we're not really doing much here. Yo, Deej! Oh my god, Deej with the 70 months. I need to see some claps in the chat for Deej. Take the fridge back. I don't want it anymore. Oh no! Oh, is good boy gonna run into a 3-3 cat? No, he's just gonna get arrowed. A giant growth when you need one. This is a position where that plus two, plus two to all my creatures would be okay. I feel like I'm not running enough combat tricks. Hey, it's not bad. Is this one of those you figured out moments? I think it is. Not. It is not. That's just a baby cloud blazer. Uh, well, nah. I'm gonna 
to bottom the land. This is our most expensive spell anyways. Oh, and, that, and I have a Devil Scry. <laughs> so notably, I cannot let damage resolve here first since I need the plus two tr or plus one oh tr trigger to finish off the guild mage, guard mage. I think this position comes down to who's going to draw their bomb first. Right now we're kind of standstilled. This card an Enforcer. It's kind of scary. Right. That's not a bomb, so that's good. Isn't Parhelion 8 mana? These are all free attacks. They don't gain any life. They can't kill any of my creatures, so... Very big board of very Im or unimpressive creatures. <gasps> they did it! Finally! Combo. Wow! Thank God I bought him to those double four or double mountains. Holy crap! They didn't turn off my mad decor, which kind of scary. Yo, Tammy's two hammies! 24 months, just over three years. Thank you, friend. Uh, that's not the play you want to make. <laughs> I mean, I guess? I don't know. I feel like I would have rather had a 4-4 four four than two 2-2s two on this board, but... That's a good card. Oh, I get double scry, so. That's worth keeping. Uh, not with a lot, but with, with enough. There's no point even blocking if they're just going to let the Dovin die anyways. Well, because it would do something later. J Loot, thank you for the four months. I think I missed you. Sorry about that. Yeah, they could have triple blocked one of the Prophets, but I think they're keeping the Cats because they probably have more. Redix, thanks for that 14 months. Welcome. Ooh, maybe they forget about the Spider. Forget about the Spider and attack into it with the Drake. Right, that's why I've been saying that a lot of my attacks are free, because they are not gaining the life from the Strays. Okay, that's a little bit annoying. I hope they forget about Nahiri giving first strike like I forgot about Nahiri giving first strike. Yes, yes, just pass! Pass! Pass priority! Oh, yeah!
Okay, enough of that. <laughs> Maybe they have something, I don't know. Wait, what? Oh god! More scries? Yes, please! They attacked with the 1-3 flyer, so it couldn't activate its ability. That's what you were getting at. I might want to bring in Steady Aim versus them. The Sarkin's Catharsis has not been entirely impressive. I kind of want to bring this in after, after seeing that game, too. We had so many creatures. Let's take out the Hellion and try it, I think. Never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna turn around and hurt you, never gonna say goodbye, better lie, we've known each other for so long, do 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 do, do 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 do. I don't think it's format dependent so much as deck dependent. There will definitely be decks where I want to run 18 land. Especially when you have some of those lands that, uh, like the Blast Zone or the Mobilized War Zone. Like those are scenarios where I could very easily see running 18 lands. This hand has a lot of potential, holy moly. Holy moly. Not contested war zone, whatever it is. Mobile, no, it's mobilized battlefield or something. You know what I'm talking about. I know you got more cats, but I'm not blocking. I got plans. To love you. Don't give, never give. Ayo, it's Tao, baby. I'm gonna get a little protection up before I run out the Zhang. Darn. Now I can't play Zhang. Actually. I can go like this. Let's go like this. Did I do this incorrectly? Did I do the wrong order? No, no I didn't. I had to use the mana by having Jang on the battlefield, right? Well then my 1-1 one -one doesn't... Uh, I guess, maybe. I think this is fine though. The crunch is already big enough. Like, we're gonna be proliferating a lot, so... Okay, here we go. Watch this turn be super nasty! I think I'm gonna leave the Zhang for now. Honestly, as long as we have the Evolution Sage and these two creatures, we don't mind drawing lands. That turn I might have done out of order. Maybe you're right. Aww. Now this land doesn't even make me happy anymore.
If they have the time wipe, so be it. I'm dead. You have three sages. Oh, and your constructed deck. Oh, did anybody listen when I played this Planeswalker? How did they pronounce their name? I'm pretty sure they say Zhang. Or Zhang or something. Somebody was telling me that's not how you pronounce it in the chat. I make this for toughness. My God, we're two and zero. Oh? That is a far cry. How did I get one win in my first draft today? Was it one and two or something? It was. It was real bad. Whatever it was. It was either one and two or two and two. I just know I didn't get any gems back. Man. What's with this mana? Oh, I should have changed up the deck. I should have taken out the Catharsis and added the like, Steady Aim trick. You get a key! So that nine months. And Dead Man Leet with the eight ball. Got the combo, heart fire with the uh, Tibby. Tumor is a very good command. All right, they don't have no escape. I mean, if you want to learn limited, just watch, watch limit absorb content like you're doing right now. Eh, I'm just gonna get the Bloom Hulk online, I guess. Since we don't have a way to give a 1 1 counter. Finally hit their second color. Oh, baby! Extra prolif? You're too kind. So many plays I could make here. So many different plays. But I think I want to just bloom again so that I can Tibalt. Without him dying. Because I do have, again, more ways to proliferate. So. Durgan! Thanks for the 31 months. Oh, combo! Let's see if they gain life. Is it worth it to kill the Wallaroons here? I think definitely so, as long as the Watley is living. Olas, two Davriel, two Narset, two Tabalt, three Spellgorgers. Wait, and Samus's sprints? What? 
Also, this is, what, 6 plus 5? We have 11 damage and burn right here. So they're just dead next turn. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. And it feels like another matchup where having another ward scale crocodile wouldn't be the stone cold worst. Let's take out that devouring. I think I'm going to make that change before going into the next round. Let's take out the devouring Hellion and... No, they didn't do anything amazing. We haven't played against somebody that's had, like, the, the, the bombies. Played against some good walkers and stuff, but... I haven't played against, like, a god yet, or... Enter the eternal God Eternals or something like that. I don't even think Blind ba uh, Blind Blast is a bad card. The Wanderer is a good Planeswalker. I is great. I haven't had Feather yet, but I've had Blind Blast. I've also never had Lily, but I've had Ugin multiple times, and I've had Sarkin multiple times. Not in draft, in sealed. I think Kaya and Asmina are two of my three top. I'm not sure what the third is yet. Oh. This is so borderline, but I'm on the draw. Yeah, Vraska's very good, for sure. Um, Angrath is good as well. No, I don't think Xiang is. Alright, alright, alright! Put the fear in them. Either have a removal or leave back a creature. Dude, that's exactly how I feel. Playing on Magic Online and having the London Mulligan just makes, yeah, every decision without the London Mulligan awful. I think that was a lot of people's experience on Arena for Sealed. I just don't even think it was really all that possible to maintain infinite. Oh, no, no, I'm sure people did, it's, but it, like, it's very hard to. Especially with uh, best of one. I think that was the true issue. Put it on your Thunder Drake and attack. Ooh. I don't even think they're going to attack this turn. Too risky, it feels like. Even attacking with just the flyer is pretty risky. Wow. Heart fire. A bad draw. I guess I didn't need to technically play the Jaya. I should have just attacked is what I should have done. They might not have blocked. I think they, they need to, but they might not have. This was probably bad, because now they just kill my Jaya too. Eh, this, is, this was just bad all over. I like getting that off the battlefield, but I, I, did, I did that incorrectly. Sure. I, 
think this card is okay. Especially if you have those uh, those three two flyers that bounce a thing. Oh man, maybe they pump the wall of ruins here. That'd be kind of funny, but it would make a little bit of sense too. Yeah, <laughs> I like it. This is basically forced to attack this turn. Jeez. I don't have good removal for that either. Alright, good boy. That is very good. When is mom draft gonna happen? She's not back home until Friday or Saturday. Ooh. No. No touchy the good boy. Oh, main phase act. Oh no! The tapping on that is so awkward. <laughs> it left him with only blue mana. Oh. Hey now, wait just a minute. Wait just a minute. That's not fair. I have a problem. I'm almost to the territory where I can... That's not even a good attack yet, because I can just block with a 3-3 and the 2-3. Three. I wish there was a way to check your sideboard. Alright, looks like their Drake's going to be a 5-6 here. I think I'm supposed to jump if they attacked there. God, this is so big! I want to draw that uh, Gather Courage card is what I want to draw. Sarko ZQ1, thank you for that Twitch Prime sub, again with the awkward auto-tapper. I currently have 13 trample damage. Probably gonna draw Evolution, Evolution Sage and be sad that I have played all my lands, but. I think I have one more Bloom Hulk. I believe I took a second Bloom Hulk over like a Jaya's Greeting, right? I believe that's the case. Oh, yeah, because of my board state, Tabalt looks. Huge in comparison to all my other cards. <laughs> Alright, there's more. Oh! They're big smorkin. Alright, well, I'm taking it and then right clicking attack all. Damn it. I'm 
I mean, I have to make this play anyways because I didn't draw a spell. Like, the spider itself did not buy me any turns after the Thunder Drake become a 5 power, right? So, I have to just attack and hope that they're dead. 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I think this is exactly lethal. No, they're highlighting something. Oh, I think I think they're they're exactly dead. My hand was forced. There was no other play I could make. I had to attack, so. My hand was forced. I just had to win. There was there was no other way around it. I had to win. Yes, they had a better block. The 2-3 could have blocked the... Um, they could have survived, is what I'm saying. They did mess up. One of their four power creatures blocked something else. Yo, Dave NF, thanks for that. Wait, sorry, one of their four toughness... Did they have two four toughness creatures? No, maybe it was just the one four. Was their army a four four or a three three? Because if their army was a three three, then they didn't... I don't think they had a better block. It was a four four? Okay, they could have survived then, yeah. Man. I have the London Mulligan, please, because this sucks. Oh, crap, I didn't make my sideboard changes either. Thanks, Dave and F, for that tier one. I guess they're just holding up counters. I don't really care if they counter Jaya. I think that was super obvious. Crush Descent would have been a little worse because of the 2-2, but that felt super obvious. I don't know. Now they'll play out like 2-3 drops that they've been sandbagging. Bond event. Oh, they have the uh, Narsets thing! They can copy it and return it to their hand. 100% they have that Narset spell. Did they just get two cards back? Jeez. Uh, I've had sealed with Bolas' Citadel, yes. Debating whether or not I want to get the 4-5 online or the 5-3. I guess the 4-5 is probably a little bit better, and it's more mana efficient anyways. Because if I play the crocodile, they might just have a random three power creature. <coughs> Excuse me. Time twist is very, well, much more likely than them having Narset's reversal. They have something. They have something at instant speed that they can cast with two blue. Be it reversal or Narset's. I don't know how I got this cut on my hand, but I have a cut on my hand apparently. Right, that's not... Just gushing all over blood. Thundercats. Ooh, they don't have another land, though. It's good for us. It's really good for us.
block and flick. I guess. Does it feel good and limited? Uh, I'm gonna say sealed doesn't feel great. I have yet to make a determination on draft, as this is my only second draft. Or only my second draft. Wow, double stealth mission! Are they just gonna go all in? Hit me for six? They totally are. Or, I guess they're not gonna attack. They probably just pass. Uh, that's a problem. Woo! Woof doggy. I mean, they're gonna make that huge anyways. I have to go face here. I can't attack Narset, otherwise they just kill me in the air. I need to try to race. Which, I mean, they kill me in two turns, so this is not gonna go well for me. Aha! I knew it! They had reversal! Oh, they, they messed up though. Okay, so I can draw Catharsis to win. If they attack. Hit me! Actually, I probably have more chance- or no, that's not true, I don't know. I'm in bad shape. Alright, baby. Catharsis. 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 Pause on upkeep. Catharsis. You guys ready? Spider would have also bought me... Oh, no, no. They, they had another one. Never mind. They had another one of those. Uh, three columns. Stealth missions. I'm gonna put in another heart fire instead of catharsis. It gives me two ways to kill their uh break. Uh you don't you don't wanna run Oh did I scry catharsis to the bottom? You're right. At the beginning of the game. God damn it. I feel like you don't want too many heart fires in a deck though. The updated hot hands. Can't have both. It's either all or the other. One or the other. All these hands have been very, very bad. <laughs> uh... Alright, I'm gonna do this, and if you have anything, I scoop. Just loot.
Eh, alright, that wasn't that bad. Oh, all in dealer. That is the fattest visionary I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> when you start start or stop looting, start lifting. <laughs> Don't have a second. Okay, thank god. See ya! We are surprisingly not dead. That feels great. I need to keep, uh, keep Zhang alive so I can cast the magic or even if I don't draw land next turn. Well, maybe I do that instead. Good boy is pretty heckin' good. No! They copy it! No! Are they targeting my creature? <laughs> that would be funny if they were. Alright, so they put it on the martyr and attack Jang, I guess. Oh, okay. That's really good for me because now I still get to attack next turn. Unless they're attack, unless they're not attacking with their dam breaker, which be which would be super awkward. Oh, does it say you control? Or this? they didn't attack. Oh my. Ah. Alright, so making it a 7-7 doesn't really do much versus the Dam Breaker anyways. Now, obviously, they still have the Stealth Mission, but on the off chance that they don't Stealth Mission and attack, I think I'm going to wait. Because if they do just Stealth Mission, attack, and pass, I do still have lethal, right? So it's kind of awkward for them. Uh-oh. Numat mom is watching. Numat Emily's watching. Ah, I see. This is fine. I mean, I'm going wider than they are. They didn't attack. Draws. Well, since they didn't utilize the stealth mission, I don't need to use... Or planeswalker. Hey, Bert Luz, thanks for the 35 months. I can pay two if they have Crushed Descent. Yeek! Oh, that's their splash, okay. We don't need to draw much. We have a lot of good outs. A lot of good outs! All right, who's gonna top deck better? Battle of the top keck.
One crunchy boy coming right up. That'll do. That. Tantaburs! Thanks for the 42 months. You've had much bigger Mowus. This is baby Mowu. Alright, looks like we go to game three. I would still make this attack, but then I wouldn't cast this card in combat like this. I would make the same attack, go to damage, and see what they do. Because if they try to kill one of my creatures, I can presumably sack something to still kill their 7-8. Double unblockable card scares me. Double stealth mission is kind of kind of annoying. Alright, no mulligans this time. Just let's keep a good seven. <coughs> okay. No transmutation one time. No transmutation one time. Oh no, and I drew Mowu to go with the Courage in Crisis. Well, if they don't do anything, I don't need to put the Courage on the crank. No, they're targeting. Maybe they're reading. If they're just reading, that's great. No, stop it. Stop it. All right, all right, all right. Well, I guess we'll just go with the big doggo then. They just have like another transmutation that the Mowu still is big. No, I want to get the Crunch Ranger online first, because if I go Crunch into Bloom Hulk, I get so much more value that way. Next turn, Crunch Wrangler is going to be a 4 3. Oh. Actually, we want to attack them with Cranko, because if they eat the Cranko with Thunder Drake, then they go to exactly 9 and then Heart Fires Lethal. Sorry, did I say go to 9? Take 9, go to 4. That's what I meant to say. Like, they can't even just wander a strike here, because they're still dead. I purposely didn't play a land since I have Evolution Sage. 
Ooh, that was a good draw. That might save them a turn. <sighs> do do do. Do do do. All uh, tumor related updates can be found there. Dang, opponent's deck is good. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Just killed. I just wanted to see if they would take lethal from regular damage. Gosh, another keepable hand. Doesn't have Cranko in it, or Mobu. But it's a goddamn keep. Wow, this is going to be pretty darn good, I would say. Sheesh. Sheesh. Sheesh! Look at that land on top with that scry. Yeah, buddy! Four three. It's four three. I don't want to just get the sage online ASAP. My friend is here to help you at home. Just don't sarkin me. They're all acceptable. It is time. I want to pass with Heartfire open, or do I want to play one of my twos? I think I'm going to pass with Heartfire. That's fine. Losing out on a scry here, but it's so much more mana efficient. Let's go. Let's go, Jaya. Into land, proliferate. <laughs> oh no! I punted! I should have. I missed out on one on one counter on one of my creatures. I'm sorry, chat. I wasn't even thinking. I got too excited. Got careless. Got careless. Uh, this is actually okay. We can play out the spider since we have the Jaya, so this devil does two damage. Right. I could have. And then the devil would have killed the 2 2 by itself. Should have really pumped the Evolution Sage, though. Because if you can get the Sage to out of 3 toughness range, or, you know, 4 toughness plus, then it's a lot harder to kill, and then this snowballs even harder than it already is. Mistakes were made. No! Alright, let's not make this mistake again. Counter on the Sage. Uber proliferate. <laughs> I 
I want to attack with this devil. I guess that's fine. Lands are better than spells at this point, honestly. Great. <laughs> I'm sure this is lethal, so I'll just uh, send them all. Is it one off? Because I can still shoot with Jaya for two, and if they kill any devil, then the devils deal two. Did I still not sideboard this? God, I'm such an idiot. I haven't brought out this stupid, uh... Uh... Alien yet. Hot hands is fine. Oh, God. I better but I better draw Cranko. That's a good draw too. If it was London Mulligan, I would have 100 percent Mulligan. But it's not, so keeping terrible sevens. Notably, I don't get a scry here, because this is an additional casting cost. So... The, uh, Prophet doesn't see that, see that I'm casting a card. start playing fat things and hope they stick. This trades with the Saratok even if they have, uh, or even if it has a 1-1 one -one counter, so. This plays around giant growth, but it also gives them the option, because now if they kill the Bloom Hulk, thinking, okay, well, at least my wolf can attack into Crocodile, well, then I kind of get him with Zhang. boy. I'm gonna start attacking next turn, I think. I need to just cranko that unless I draw Jaya. We'll see how they block here. Actually, no, no. All right, I'm gonna kill this. And I want to do it on my turn in case they have a giant growth, because even though they'd be able to save it, then at least I wouldn't have to fight through six goblins or whatever, five goblins. Every everybody important is red. Oh, that's a lot of damage.
Oh god, attack with everything. Please, leave yourself dead on board. Just attack with everything. 5, 10, 14, I would go to 5. I don't think I can afford to go to 5. I think I'm gonna block. I don't like it. Especially when their crunch is turning into a 2-1, but... I put out if I put on a counter and attack, I do technically have them on a two turn clock, but then they can attack me back and just play a creature next turn. Top deck battle. Ooh, mama. That seems bad for me. I am hot. No problem. Fire can't stall. You have a mountain to cast that? Aha! No mountain. Alright, I need to draw a spell this turn. Oh! Yes! Yes, it's good. How many lands in that? Is that in a row? Alright, that's a brick. I got an eight. Is it me you're looking for? Boy, Diferous. Thanks for that fifty one months. I don't lose life if they minus seven. Do I? Oh, it's not like the other planes walkers. They have a bond of passion in their deck. Okay. Well, do uh, I would say maybe just one too many lands. That's it. Just yeah, just one or too many. Turn three, Cranko. This is close. I think it's a mulligan, but it's 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 close to a keep. All right. Hoping to draw just two lands. Turn two, Crunch. Turn th or turn four, Bloom would not be a bad curve. Would love to draw Cranko here, and then a land. Kind of crazy. <sighs> Hopefully they just play like a- Oh! No land for you! GG. Flood is okay if they just miss lands. Ruined. I'm dead. And we're probably fine. Again, it's hard to say right now, as this is this is my second sealed, so. Jeez.
word mixing. I do a lot of spoonerisms. Whether that's because I've been streaming for literal decades. Maybe it's the tumor behind my pituitary gland. Who really knows? And maybe it's Maybelline. T oh, they're just taking lethal. They're not even... Okay. I accept. Didn't even need to sideboard out the Devouring Hellion. We just did it. We just frickin' did it. God, so many packs. So many goodies! None of these are good. Well, none of these are goodies. I'll put the goodies I want anyways. This channel is sponsored by Inked Gaming. Go to InkedGaming.com for awesome playmats, dice bags, and more.